All right, so we set up our engine here, and we got our, our pipe going, but we don't we don't want it to to do to what it's doing right now. We want it to be able to generate power on its own. So now we can do that. Set up a waterproof pipe like so. This cobblestone pipe, and that's going to now power. It's going to power itself. It's still filling up this guy over here, but it's also receiving energy from the uh, the pump. So now lava is going to continuously, and we'll be able to continuously pump fluids out of here and into this guy. So there we go. Now this thing is is self-sufficient. It's it's filling up with lava. And it's con to continue to power our engine, and we're filling up our our uh, our tank here. That was quick. But in the next part, I'm going to show you how to set that up to an ender tank so that we can take this lava and put it over in the real world. Coming up, running.